Hi everyone. In this series of videos I will show you how the single digit code, the Fibonacci sequence, and vortex math, or what I call matrix math, prove the existence of all creation and that all things stem from the zodiac in the material world. This is a topic that we have been discussing in my Discord group, so if you want to discuss it further or you have any questions or comments, please go to my Discord group and address it there. Much of what I present in this series originates from Lord Osseron's work based on the single digit code, the vortex math wheel, the tree of life, and the tarot placements on the zodiac. For more information, please go watch his channel and I will leave a link to it in the description box. In this video, I will be solely focusing on the single digit code, which is 0 to 9. Nine is the same as zero as it essentially disappears when you add it to any other digit. Zero is source, no thing. Nine is simultaneously everything and no thing. Nine denotes the journey that zero takes from one to eight to return to nine or home. One plus two plus three plus four plus five plus six plus seven plus eight equals 36. Three plus six equals nine. Using 0 through 9, I will show you how these digits repeat themselves to infinity to create the matrix kundalini grid. This is the basis of all creation. To build the grid, you reduce the multiplication tables 1 through 9. Reducing the numbers shows their true value. For instance, 12 is 1 plus 2 equals 3. 12 is 3 digits above 9. 53 equals 5 plus 3 equals 8. 53 is 8 digits above 45, which is the last multiple of 9 before 53. Another way to look at it is the number divided by 9 and you take its remainder, also known as a Pisano period. Simply do this for all the numbers between 1 and 9 and then place them on the grid. You will notice patterns emerge. 7227 is dead center. It is framed by the kundalini grid of 3, 6, and 9. 1 and 8 is the alpha and omega. The kundalini grid is framed by 7, 11, or 7, 2, 2, 7. 6, 4, 6 is 7, and 3, 5, 3 is 11, or 2. Seven eleven shows up again in the corners. One plus two plus three plus two plus three equals eleven. Six plus seven plus eight plus seven plus six is thirty four. Three plus four is seven. Draw a diagonal line through the middle, and you'll see that numbers are mirrored on either side. The center line has a pattern of four nine four nine four. The same is true for the other side. Only the center line has a pattern of 59595. The middle cross reduces to 9. 4 plus 5 is 9. Horizontally, numbers are inverted mirrors and reduced to 9. The same is true vertically. You'll notice the numbers repeatedly pair up in 1 and 8, 2 and 7, 3 and 6, 4 and 5 because they add to 9. This grid fits onto itself to infinity. Wow. 
This also works in a 3D cube pattern. This matrix is the building block of creation. The cube, or cross, the XX of the IXXI, the diamond pattern, This video is an introduction to vortex math. I'm sure you've seen this elsewhere. It's not revolutionary, but it's fundamental to some deeper understandings as I build on this foundation.